one thing about it, I get whatever I want. Okay? I get whatever I want. <laughs> Do not mind me. I am a mess. Like, I am a mess. And I knew better. But, <sighs> listen. Welcome back to another video, y'all. It's your girl T. I'm back with another one. I'm finna brush it out right now. I'm putting on my clothes. I'm finna head out for the day. Um. So, y'all. So, I didn't get in the house to... 5 a.m. last night because me and Malika decided to be outside. And I have a whole one-on-one -on -one deluxe training today. And y'all know I'm bringing y'all with me regardless, tired or not. Let me get these pants up. Oh, not these pants is too freaking small. And then I got these nails. I could barely. Oh. You know, these are gonna be uncomfortable like this. These might not make it. Hold on, y'all. Okay, y'all. So, we didn't get in till like 5 a.m. And I had a, I have a one on one. Uh, I have a one on one deluxe training this morning at 11. And I still have a couple errands to run for it. So, y'all, I'm taking y'all with me today. Um, Yeah. One-on-one -on -one deluxe training. So that is, I'm teaching my student volume. I mean, classic lashing. And then we're gonna turn around and do volume. I don't know how long this training is gonna be. I haven't did a deluxe in so long. But I know one thing, I need me some water. I need me a Red Bull. And I need me a coffee. Not just one of those things, I need all three of them okay i don't know why i thought i was one of them girls but i'm not one of them girls um i played myself but i'm gonna get it together and i'm gonna do what i gotta do because one thing about it i'm gonna get my coin by all means i don't play that shit i was in by five i was up by eight okay thank you very much my house is a mess that's crazy um oh my god my house is a mess from getting dressed last night, but I have to make sure I got all my stuff. So I just threw my one-on-one -on -one stuff in here. I gotta go to Dollar Tree and Office Depot to get the rest of her stuff, like her bag. Um, I got um, some stuff in my trunk as well. So yes, y'all, I just want to start this vlog. I don't know what this vlog is going to be, <clears throat> but I always, always, always vlog my one-on-ones because YouTube vlogging for my one-on-ones is literally promo for my one-on-ones. I'm always taking one-on-ones every single day, y'all. It's not one single day that I don't offer my one-on-one -on -one trainings. My one-on-one -on -one trainings are also um, discounted at a natural rate right now. So if you go, you can get any of my trainings for a discounted price, whether it's just the classic, whether it's classic of volume, and whether it's volume. But once stuff starts picking up for me again, the prices will go up. So I just love all the girls that are taking advantage of my discounted rate as I grow in my new city. Um, <clears throat> I literally have a one-on-one -on -one today and then I have somebody inquire about a one-on-one -on -one next week. That is what I'm talking about. That is what I like, okay? Oh, I'm gonna get my batteries. I got two charged batteries and I didn't even know I was vlogging today. Ain't that just crazy, y'all? Huh? My hair was so cute yesterday, and I just took my clip-ins out because I can't sleep in them, y'all. I don't know about y'all, but I cannot sleep in clip-ins. That shit's too uncomfortable. But anyway, y'all, I'm about to uh, focus so I can leave the house at a reasonable time because I am on a time, a strict time um, limit today. I feel so bad because Tito has not ate, and quite frankly, he is about to eat like this. Cause he know I can't do it like that. But I'm gonna try to be off at a reasonable time today. Y'all know I'm crazy. Look, it's a whole hoop of tip in my purse. 
I'm gonna start carrying these when I go outside. Y'all, it's gonna be a dangerous summer. This is gonna be my summer. I'm about to be booked and busy, but I'm still about to be living my life because it's my first um, summer in Houston, y'all. So it's up and it's already starting and it's just like, oh my God, am I ready for this? Oh my God, it's time to start being back outside, y'all, because I don't go nowhere. But baby, literally outside killing me already. But all right, I'll see y'all in a second, y'all. If you are in the Houston area, book your lash appointment, book your lash one-on-one -on -one training with me. If you are watching this you discount YouTube client to get more money off the already discounted rates, make sure you are subscribed. And let's get this day started. I'll see y'all in a second. Okay, y'all, so I just left Dollar Tree or whatever. Oh my God, the man, I mean, not Dollar Tree, Office Depot, he literally just, I'm not gonna tell y'all who he was, but I think he liked me, y'all, because this man just gave me his number and told me to call him sometime, and then gave me my prints for free. Y'all, literally, I did not have to just pay for my client menu and my client certificate. And the certificate on that good paper. Y'all know what paper I'm talking about. That thick paper, like that paper your certificate is supposed to be printed out on. But okay, y'all, I'll see y'all the first letter. I'm finna go in Dollar Tree and get some stuff. And I'll see y'all in a minute. So I always like to get my, my student some water. And baby, I need some too. I don't know what kind this is, but this is what we drinking today. Cause, uh, yeah, no. I know I'm on a diet, so I'm not gonna get too many snacks. But I think I might buy us some pizza, so. Just trying to find her a notebook and a pen. I got everything else. Let's see. Dang. They should always be a damn mess. Y'all, so they don't have no more helium. So I have to choose from these. Balloons already blown up. I really want to do all flower balloons because this is my first spring one-on-one. -on -one. But, oh, I do see one, but it's not attached to, y'all see it? It's not attached to the thing, so. I might have to just get some stars. I don't even have no pink ones blown up. That's so crazy. Oh my God. Okay, I'll just get these. Okay guys, so I have made it. Oh, my battery about to die.com. I have made it, but y'all look at this. He binded my one-on-one -on -one manual. Okay, yeah, y'all, so he binded my one-on-one -on -one manual and everything y'all like literally i love that and then this is her certificate y'all hear that that good paper so i am currently at the suite and i'm gonna set up my girl so i always keep plenty folders i always keep a lot of stuff for my one-on-one y'all because it's like kind of like a manifestation thing for me like i keep them on deck because i know i'm gonna have another one and another one and another one so I'ma just put her certificate in this folder. So it'll be in there all neat and stuff. Put her main one on top of there. Ugh. So y'all, this is where all her stuff came in. This box, her whole kit. As y'all can see, when y'all take my one-on-one, -on -one, kit fully loaded, baby. Fully loaded, don't play. The bag. They didn't have, y'all, my one-on-one -on -one is very interesting today because I usually have all pink stuff, but literally Dollar Tree was tripping. So here's her manual. We work with the manual, so I like to sit up there. And then, look, kick, still jumping, baby, all up in there. So I'm going to put her stuff in here, real neat. Like down to the electrical thing, the blue ring, big pack. Don't 
play with the instructor. Silicone pads, baby. That good pink tape. Cutie. Some little scissors. iPads. Applicators. Two tweezers. Pink. Mascara wand. Tweezer cleaner, baby. Remover and glue. Okay. And that's her kit. Oh, the volume kit is in this little one. Cause she's taking a classic in a volume with me. So here's her volume tweezers. And then her volume trays are in here. Um, point seven. And then where is these are what my volume one-on-one -on -one training. What I train with. So I keep a pack of these. Put those in there. So she got two of those. And then her cleanser. So she literally just texted me and told me to let her know when I'm up here. I'm about to set her balloons up. These are her balloons that I got. Congrats. So cute, right? Dollar Tree is a mess. So I always give my students a notebook to take further notes with and then a pen and a highlighter to highlight stuff. Cause when I was in college y'all, I was really big on highlighting. Like highlighting and light is what did it for me. So put her pen up in there. I look a mess y'all. She probably gonna be like, my structure is ugly as hell. Got her a water as well as me one. And then y'all always buy thank you cards from the Dollar Tree. And I write them a little note because literally I love anybody that takes my training so much, like to the highest extent. And I have to show my appreciation that way. And then I got some napkins for when we get started. I'm gonna just throw all this in here and unravel her stuff. I just texted her and told her I'm in here so she can come on up. So yeah, hold on y'all, I'll be right back. Okay y'all, so my girl finna walk in. This is her balloons. I should have probably did all white, but I'm a pink type of girl, so yeah. Volume kit, classic kit, mannequin, Notebook, certificate and folder, um, manual. Oh, let me get her highlighter. Highlighter. So then y'all, while I wait for her, I usually um, read my manual, read the manual through my training on my laptop. So I'm gonna get my laptop. I'm probably gonna do it from here and get it set up. Okay guys, so my student has arrived. She is so pretty. What's your name, girl? Jocelyn. Jocelyn, are you ready, girl? <laughs> Y'all, this training is about to be amazing because she's already...
hard, so you know. Okay. Good. So let's just say, let's see what kind of. I had to create the fans and put them on this, mm -hmm. but we can do both. We can do this and then. Um, as y'all know, it was a classic in the volume training. So we had the um, the classic part already. And then we was working on her volume fans or whatever. So she just basically like cut it short. But anyway, y'all, today is a new day. Um, I forgot to tell y'all. So the dude at Office Depot, I hope he never see this video. But he had office, the dude at Office Depot or whatever. I came, I went to that Office Depot one time when I first moved to Houston. And he gave me a really good deal on my um, business flyers and my business cards that I had printed when I first moved here. My Welcome to Houston flyers or whatever. So I never seen him again. I always go there because I be like, oh, he be plugging. Like, let me go there. So yesterday, you know, I came with my natural tresses or whatever. And I remember... I was having a hard time at the kiosk. He was like, I'll just, you know, I'll just help you come over here. We'll get you together, blah, blah, blah. So, um, he helped me. He binded her manual. He printed out her, um, certificate with the car stock paper. Like, I didn't even have to tell him. And it was free 99, y'all. Then he gave me a compliment. He was like, you know, I don't want to be weird or whatever, but it feels like it's so good to see a woman with hair actually like rocking her hair, looking so beautiful with hair coming out of her scalp. Like none of that frontal stuff blah blah like just giving me my flowers or whatever i'm like thank you and when he gave me all my stuff and he was like you're good go and gave me his number he wrote his number on a piece of paper like call me sometime i was like listen pretty privilege is a motherfucking fool baby and if you think this not gonna be a good summer for the pretty bitches you're crazy but yeah yesterday was so good it was my first one-on-one one-on-one -on -one, one -on -one of the spring y'all spring is springing like my energy is even feeling a little different these days, but it still be in and out, in and out. So, whatever. But, it, like I said, y'all, it's the next day. And I really want to read y'all this message that I got today. One second. Okay, y'all. So, I just want to read y'all. My battery's one that I had to go change it, y'all. But, I literally woke up today in such a good mood because it's so crazy because people don't. Like, people really just be so... Oops, sorry. 
people y'all are really just so genuine and i love when people like genuinely like send me messages with no intentions or no type of motive they just want to deliver they have like i feel like people watch you they see you they support you and they genuinely be wanting to give you your flowers and like reach out to you and i think that's so genuine and so sweet when people do the stuff that i'm gonna read y'all they just never know like she just be right on time for people and you just never know you just being genuine you you know you see a motherfucker and you see somebody and you just want to get it off your chest i just feel like how this message this morning like came like right on time like literally right on time so i don't know who this person is y'all um and if you're watching this you know who you are and thank you so much for these kind words like it really made my morning um i literally cried a little bit when i um read this because it's just so crazy stuff just be right on time like people will reach out to you with the kindest words and not even knowing like you was crying that morning or not saying i was crying this morning or just not even knowing like oh today i woke up on like the wrong side of the bed or you know i've been deep in my thoughts today like they don't even know they're just being genuine and it can hit right on time exactly when you need it so i read this message i got this message y'all my whole mood changed like i just feel so good like so like if y'all ever like feel like y'all see a person and y'all just want to get them their flowers or you just it's been on your mind to tell a person something literally just reach out to that person like put your pride to the side reach out to that person because you just never know like you can make somebody there so let me stop talking real quick let me let me read this to y'all like i said i don't know this person this person has zero followers zero pictures zero posts zero everything it, it looks as if they made this page just to reach out to me so they wrote me and they said, been watching your videos since Milwaukee. You are such a boss. I've noticed in your vlogs lately, you've been a little down. The clientele will come. You are a phenomenal lash tech and a boss. It may not be as quick as you like, but it will come. Enjoy life, but don't compare yourself to what you see around you. You are blessed and highly favored. Go to more influencer networking events collab with them as far as your youtube videos maybe shorter talking segments not because we don't want to hear it because people have short attention spans when it comes to household content like cooking cleaning chilling try to give us wider angles put the phone on a tripod that gives a wider view of the layout make it aesthetically pleasing i say all this to let you know god's got you your supporters have you you are extremely talented everything you want in me hold on y'all okay so i almost started crying and i just don't like crying on camera but everything you want and need will come keep your head up you are forever a queen success is in you in anything you touch like literally that made my day like people just don't know when you need stuff like because i just love when people like reach out to me with positive words like they see that like i'm a good person or like i'm hard working because sometimes like i don't give myself enough credit sometimes i'm too i be too stuck on like what i could be doing or what i want to be doing or where i want to be at and literally be like forgetting like i once prayed for to be where i'm at and i'm just and I, like actually like giving myself the credit like girl you're doing fine you're doing fine like you're doing amazing actually but i'm very hard on myself and it shows in my work ethic and stuff like that so it's just like good for people like to know that people like that support you like see that and like you know it kind of opened my eyes like Tiana, stop being so hard on yourself then it's just like i love when people like write me with just like su such like positively strong words because i feel like a lot of time like especially these days y'all i feel like I'm really misunderstood for real. I feel like people really try to make me out to be like a certain, like it's just a whole lot of stuff though. But this message just cleared the air. Like I just love it. And if you send me that message, like I love you. I don't know who you are. You never tell me who you are. Um, It's like not even a real account for real that sent that to me. Like literally. So I just want to thank y'all for that. I'm about to hop on a business call real quick um, because I got a call in the middle of me talking and i'm gonna come back on here and talk to y'all but i gotta hop on this call real quick so because business is gonna be real booming real quick so i gotta talk straight business. yeah because i was doing something why you ain't been calling me
Okay, y'all, I'm back. So, everything is everything. I'm sorry, y'all. I almost cried or whatever on camera. Um, so, I loved in that message how she gave me advice on, um, you know, me, like, saying, like, y'all want to see more aesthetically pleasing, like, content, like, you know, angling the phone a different way or a different, whatever she said in the message. I get that. I love that type of content, but not today. Cause baby, my house is a mess. Clean it, but I want to do a little mini unboxing with y'all. Let me do it on the couch. I feel like I'm always in the kitchen. I gave you more than you wanted. Today I'm finna unbox this um package that I got. It's the company that I'm doing. Um, I have a sponsorship with. They reached out to me and they got this to me so freaking quick, y'all. Like, I feel like I just fill out the paperwork. I mean, I just fill out the form to receive my package. Okay, so. Oh, wow. This is so cute. It looks so relaxing just off the branding. Okay. So, anyway, y'all. So, this is the company that I'm working with um, that I have a sponsorship through. It is called Body Restore, y'all. And basically what this is, this is like a shower bomb. I can't wait to open it. I'm going to open it in a minute. But it's a shower bomb and it's called Spring Botanical Mix. And basically it says it's a simple shower upgrade for true serenity. So it comes with six tablets. And it says that it's supposed to dial down stress and prepare for relaxation with the shower experience featuring a blend of Body Restore's favorite scents. So it tells me that the scents are eucalyptus. Jasmine, citrus, this word, lavender, and bergamot spring. Three benefits. This sticker is over the other one, and it says it's supposed to enhance your mood. So I'm so excited to use this, y'all, because y'all, as y'all know, some days be better than others. And y'all know I'm it's not my time of the month. So you know your mood swings be at an all-time high. You be real moody. You happy, you sad, you glad you mad you know so i'm so excited to use this i actually might use it tonight um let me see damn okay i couldn't use my nail because they're super sharp strong okay so this is what it is y'all these are the tablets I guess you place one tablet on shower floor away from heavy stream of water. So I'm guessing you probably um, put this like in the back of your shower or you put it somewhere where the water, it, the water from the water hose isn't directly on it. Like, so you want to put it somewhere in the shower that doesn't have a lot of water retention or not a lot of water retention, but basically you want to put this at the bottom of your shower, wherever the water don't put a lot of pressure y'all know what i'm trying to say i can't even get it out you got balance resets oh my god this is what i want to use like reset i would probably use this probably like sunday night when i'm taking a shower or probably like sun um monday morning like for like a reset um calm relief and energize so i would probably use one of these maybe like a day when i don't have to work after i leave the gym and um maybe i'm just sitting at home or whatever don't have nothing to do i might put these i might do this one so y'all i'm super duper excited i'm required to do a reel or a tiktok on it so I'll probably do, I'm thinking about doing like a, um, maybe like a morning routine or a like, um, y'all know like a night routine and then put this in the shower when I get in the shower or something, something cute like that. It's going to be so cute because my bathtub, my bathroom aesthetic is really, really cute. Like my shower is really cute. So yeah, y'all body restore. I can't wait to show y'all. I might um, use it once tonight and show y'all, but I cannot wait to um, use it and tell y'all how I like it. Y'all look at my nails. Uh, I didn't take y'all with me to get these done because the day I went to go get them done, I was rushing. 
But y'all, look at my nails. They so cute. Let me show y'all. So y'all, I'm stepping into a new season. Y'all know it's spring season. It's It's been warm in Texas, but it's finna get warm all around the world. Like summer is approaching, but we're currently in our spring season, y'all. And I just wanted to try something new with my nails. Y'all know I don't really do too much with my nails. I don't get like designs and stuff like that. I do want to start trying those, but I was like, I want to switch up my nails for the season. So I tried my stiletto, my long stiletto. I tried a different shape, which is stiletto. Um, I've gotten stiletto before, but I stopped getting stiletto long because I started like not liking them. But y'all, these are cute. And then y'all know I usually get like black or like white. I don't really be getting like color nails no more, but I decided to try pink because pink is in season. It's giving my Barbie season, you know, my money season. Like I just love these. Okay. And then I love how they're pink, but they're matte. It's a matte pink. So that's why they look dry. I like it. And I think I'm going to stick to these to long nails for May. But it's season. I usually like to do um, long nails in the summer because it gives like summer vibes like long nails and then short nails gives like you know winter vibes i'm working getting ready for the summer and stuff but we're gonna see how long these last definitely will be being in the gym because i don't i don't know how this is gonna work but we'll see i haven't been in the gym in two days because i did not go yesterday because i had my one-on-one -on -one training in the morning so i wasn't gonna be able to make it and y'all know i had a long night prior to that so it ain't like i could wake up early and go no and then today i'm officially cramping so i just couldn't do it, but I will be in the gym tomorrow. So we're gonna see how these nails work with that. Um, I'm gonna try and fo five. Is it fu? I'm gonna try fu today. So it's this place that I seen right next door to my nail shop when I got my nails done. And I'm like, oh my god, it's like a fu place. And I'm like, oh my god, I've been wanting to try fu so freaking bad. So I'm taking myself on a self date today, and I think that's really, really good because I don't have to work today. I'm really just chilling and I have to, um, y'all know I've been telling y'all about my new little business venture and I have to sit down and really get some last minute things done for that. I'm currently waiting on the rest of my outfit. So that's what's really like pushing it back. I was supposed to have it like this week, but I think we're going to move it to next week and I'm going to be fully prepared next week. So, um, I have some stuff I want to get done with that too or whatever. So I'm going to get some work done and take myself on a self date. Um, I don't know if they have a patio, but if they have a patio, I'm going to sit outside because I think it's nice outside. But I'm so, 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 so excited to try pho, y'all. And I'm going to take y'all with me today. Um, I know pho is basically like soup, but I've never had it and I'm ready to try it. And I'm going to try something else there too, depending on what's on the menu. But yeah, I'm taking y'all with me to try pho. Um, and I'm excited about that. So that's really what I'm doing today. I don't really got much planned. Um, but these days, y'all, I've been outside, like, worry about what's not being posted, okay? Ah! I've been having a fucking ball, y'all, in life. Like, I see where life is going, for real. Like, I see where life is going. Like, I really feel like this is my season. Like, I'm just enjoying every little piece of life these days. Like, i just been having a good time, y'all. Like, putting my phone down, not recording, like just enjoying the moment and it's just been amazing like it's just been amazing i'm not hiding nothing from y'all or whatever but i just want to let y'all know like this summer is looking like a whole lot of money and a whole lot of fun like for me like <laughs> i'm so excited um yeah y'all i'm gonna get up and play my music and clean up my house or whatever um i will show y'all my outfit that came for my um for my uh my marketing campaign for my next business venture but then again, it might be too soon. Because y'all know I don't like showing y'all stuff till y'all see it on the gram. You know, whatever. So, I'm not going to show y'all that. I'll show y'all that in the vlog that I do for that. But until then, I'm about to clean up my house and get shit done. Because I got to uh, get this vlog out. I haven't gave y'all a vlog in like two days. And I've been really, really consistent. I've been really, really trying to shoot out like content every two days. I mean, not every two days, but at least twice a week for y'all. So, yeah anyway i don't want to get on here talking too much or whatever i'm about to get up get my life in order clean up my house a little bit um get in the shower and head out i'm gonna try to be out by um three today but i don't know how that'll work but it's no rush i'm just going to get fun and i'm gonna take y'all with me to show y'all i'm so excited so yeah y'all 
if you made it this far in this vlog, make sure you subscribe because I probably actually I told I probably told y'all that yesterday. But today I am reminding y'all subscribe. Don't ever think you got too much pride or you too much of that girl to subscribe to a bitch channel like me. Okay, don't ever think that. Okay, so I love y'all and I'll see y'all in a couple hours. Okay, guys, I'm back. So I'm on my way out the door. Um, I just pinned my hair up any type of way, y'all, honestly. Um, I just want to show y'all my clip. Real cute, real girly. Y'all know the dress is giving whatever it needs to give. You know. Y'all know one thing about it. A dress gon' dress on me, like, for real. Every time. Let me show y'all. Uh, let me put my purse on. He think he going with me. He ain't. So, y'all know the dress gon' dress regardless. Y'all see the shape in the dress, you know? No edits. None of that. Just, y'all know what's going on. Y'all know I always gotta hype myself up. But, yeah. Okay, so, I am about to leave my house. Like I said, y'all, I'm just trying faux today. I feel like I needed to get dressed, like get cute, because why not? Um, You look good, you feel good. So, I just threw on a cute little dress Cause it's nice outside and shit, why not? And I hope they got a patio cause that go with my whole vibe today. But um, yeah y'all, I'm finna leave. I'm actually looking for my notebook. I don't know where I put it. Where is my notebook at? Mm, cause I might record some type of content like a reel or something. So. I'm trying to find y'all this little boy. Look, look, look. He's on my heels. On oh my heels. Like, oh my God. I can't even think straight because you. Hold on, y'all. Okay, y'all. So I finally made it out the house. I just want to get on here and just show y'all. Like, I know I be, you know, teasing y'all and I be wearing like clips and shit, but this all my hair. All my edges. They're a little nappy right now. But yeah, y'all. So. I'm on my way to this faux, okay, pho place. Um, I think it's called pho, pho, pho. I don't know. I'm gonna show y'all the name when I get there. But I just want to update y'all and let y'all know I'm on the way. And it's like kind of by my house, so I'm gonna be there kind of quick. So I'll see y'all in a second. Like damn, she need her move. 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 She lit, got money too. Like damn, she need her move. Okay guys, so as y'all can see, I made it. Um, I just ordered pho, I mean pho, and shrimp fried rice. So yes, I'm excited. Mm. And I probably don't eat that, so. Something really creative for my clients for uh, client appreciation, my client appreciation sale for May. So that's what I'm about to do while waiting on my food. And um, yeah, I'll see y'all when I show y'all my food when it come out. I don't know what to do. Oh my god, y'all, here it is. Oh, I'm so excited. 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 I'm so exc
Like damn, she need her move. 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 She lit, get money too. Okay, you guys, so I just got done in there. I'm so mad because I literally made a mess. Like, look at my notebook. It got that sauce all on it, like making it look toe up. And I literally just got this notebook from Five Below. Um, Cause I love new notebooks. Anyway, y'all, that fa, I was just gonna call it fo. Fa, that fa was a 10 out of 10, y'all. Like. It was very, very good. I'm not going to lie. It was so good. Um, the station fried rice was good, too. And I put, like, some of that little hot sauce, little stuff on there that they gave me. But, yeah, it was good. I'm definitely a fuck girl. I'm going to be eating pho. So, if y'all been thinking about trying pho, go try pho right now. Run, don't walk, and try pho. So, I need a black pump for my marketing campaign for my next business venture that I've been telling y'all I've been working on most likely i'm going to get the marketing campaign done next week so um my outfit is here i'm waiting on another piece for my outfit and then i need a black pump for the look that i'm going for and i don't feel like ordering off amazon i don't feel like ordering it i don't feel like putting my car number in i don't feel like waiting on it i just want to go pick something up because i literally it literally don't have to be too much so I need a back pump and I literally just typed in black pump near me and it's a store literally right here right near me like four minutes away that has the and they have it in my size but I'm about to go pull up and make sure they really have it for real but it was a couple places that popped up that have a black pump so if they don't have it then I'll try somewhere else but I'm not gonna do that today I'm just going to this one because it's store because it's in the area and it's called rack room shoes and the pumps is only forty dollars or whatever and i love that i love that and i wish they was twenty dollars i hope when i get there they're fifteen dollars because literally i'll probably never wear these shoes again <laughs> and my look is giving y'all it's giving like it, it gives the body justice like Wait till y'all see this like i didn't gave y'all eight months now i didn't gave y'all eight months but i'm coming back okay sis is coming back i'm back i'm back outside with it so i cannot wait for y'all to see what i have cooking up i'm so excited for my next business venture y'all just don't know how it feels to sit down like when you somebody that always got something in motion and you literally have to take a mental break that right there mentally fucks you up because it's just like what the hell like i ain't i ain't used to doing nothing like and it's so crazy because i've been sitting back doing nothing but at the same time i've been working i've been planning i've been working i've been planning and i've been plotting but i just ain't really been putting nothing into to action because y'all i'm just y'all know the vibes i'm too excited because 
my vision. I'm finna tear their ass up within a couple seconds. I'm finna tear their ass up. Ah, I'm so excited, y'all. So anyway, I'm on my way to Rack Room Shoes, which is, they say, it's literally straight ahead. Where is this at? Where? All right, Coco. Coco knows she care about her mama. She like, mama, put your motherfucking seatbelt on and stop playing. But okay, y'all, I'm gonna see y'all when I get there and I'm gonna show you the little pump. So y'all, this is the store. It kind of look like a, um, what's them stores called? Uh, what is that store? Famous footwear. It look like famous footwear in here. So, yeah. Okay, y'all, so here is the pump I was telling y'all about. And this is the brand Michael Shannon. Look at this, y'all. This is perfect for what I'm going for. And when I put my look together, y'all see, y'all gonna see. So, I wear an 8, but I might go a size up. But I actually like how they got Steve Madden brand, too, y'all. These ones is more expensive though. These is a hundred dollars. I will never pay a hundred dollars for these for what I'm doing it for. I only need it for what a couple hours. So back to what's important. Let's try this baby. Is it giving kidney heal? I don't know. Cause these is a little bit higher. These is a little, this kind of more of an arch. Let me see. You got a steam metal one got a little bit more of an arch. But yeah, we're gonna go with this one. Period poo. Yeah. Uh, welcome back. It is later in the night, y'all. It's 9.25. And, um, I've been back at home for probably like a couple hours. Um, after I left, what's that called? Rack room shoes. I just came home and chill and did some work on my computer. So y'all can see I'm back in my robe. Cause one thing about it, I'm gonna come home and I'm gonna take off all my clothes, get in the shower, and put my robe on. So, yeah, y'all, I'm literally working on uh, not a video, but um, literally, y'all see later what I'm working on. Tomorrow, I'm starting, I'm getting back on that because I was doing so good. I want to gain like three to five pounds in my lower body because I know three to four pounds, babe, I'm going to look good. So, I, I got to make sure I'm getting the proper protein so I'm gaining the proper weight. So, I'm back on my healthy shit tomorrow. Um, yeah, tomorrow I don't really have no plans. Probably get up, go to the gym, come back, chill, and we're supposed to be going to lunch, so I'll probably go to lunch after I get done with the gym. Probably like 1, 2 o'clock, not sure. So, yeah, I'm going to go to chill for the rest of the night, and I'll probably see y'all tomorrow. Y'all, Tito be right underneath me. Like, I always almost dip on him whenever I get off the couch. Look at him, he always right under me. He never too far. Okay, y'all, I have to just, you know, get my shit off because 
Yeah, that was my song. Okay, y'all. So, have I talked to y'all today? No, I have not talked to y'all today. Hey, y'all. Welcome back to another day. So, today I told y'all that I'm going to... Hold on. I got to change my battery one second. Okay, y'all. So, today I'm about to go to Lost and Found with Coco. Y'all go meet Coco because I'm going to show y'all Coco, but... I'm going to show y'all Coco, but today I'm about to go to Lost and Found. So, I've been up and out already, y'all. Literally, I didn't, I've been getting shit done. I got up, went to the gym, left the gym, went to Subway, did a reel at Subway for promo for myself because I didn't gave, like, dang near, like, 80 people my Subway recipe and they keep tagging. So, I'm just like, let me make a reel and put it on TikTok because you never know. So, I did a reel, came back, did my makeup, got dressed. Y'all, my hair has been... And it's like curly type of vibe lately. So I just put it in like a curly ponytail with a little bang curl. Literally, I haven't had to put no heat on my hair, y'all, because I didn't went to the gym. My hair still look like this. Um, my baby hair is gonna stay down. So what y'all be doing for y'all baby hairs? How y'all get y'all baby hairs to stay? You know, my house is back a mess. This is crazy to me. Like, literally, this is crazy. So, yeah, it's just an effortless hairstyle, y'all. I just got the bang. But my baby hairs will not stay. And that's so irritating. But I have to, I'm going to try to put some hairspray on it. Work for me. It don't be staying. It do not be staying. So, I use this hairspray. I bought this hairspray when I had did my flips. And it held my flips for the whole day. So let's see. My side baby hair right here usually stay. It's this one right here that never stays. And I just don't know why. Oh my God. My life. They say it don't, it don't. I don't even care. <sighs> my house gonna be a mess. So y'all, I'm about to go to um Lost and Found with her. I'm probably gonna stay there for like an hour and a half. Because I have to. Me and um, Keon is doing a video today. If you're watching this, you have already seen that I posted on my Instagram. Ask me and Keon some questions. Y'all asked us some good questions too. Like, this would be a good video. I'm so excited. But, yeah, my little outfit cuter than ever. Look at that ass, y'all. Look at that. 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 Mm, 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 mm. Y'all know the vibes. But yeah, set is from Zara. Y'all, I'm about to do a Zara haul on my page. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to start doing Zara hauls too. Because y'all know I'm a Zara brand ambassador. And I haven't even really like got into it yet. Like I'm supposed to. But I already know how I'm coming when I come when I come. So y'all need to stay on the lookout. I want to start doing um small Zara hauls for y'all. So I can be pushing out that content. Like I don't want to do super duper duper long Zara hauls. But I do want to do like short Zara hauls. Like for the girls to go cop the real pieces for the summer. Because summer is coming y'all. And y'all have to have y'all pieces ready information. But okay y'all. I'm about to leave the house. I'm going to lock Tito up or whatever. And I'll see y'all when I get there. Okay? okay. Let me hurry up for the music. Come back on. What's your name, girl? My name is Coco, the jeweler on Instagram. My name is Coco. So, you also this is Coco. This is who I was talking about earlier. Where? But Coco, where are you from? Talking like this. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't right. I'm from Mobile, Alabama. That, she said I'm country, but I don't think I'm country. Y'all think <laughs> everything you said it just scream country. <laughs> Y'all think I'm country? Let me know. Cause I don't think I'm country. Let me know, y'all. So we is at Ooh, don't mind my lotion. Got me at the Lost and Found. Yes, I ain't yeah. been at the Lost and Found in so long. Before we go, it's good. Good hell. All right. Uh, Ooh. So we told Tito we was gonna get some Zara hauls. Yeah. We told him to success. We told him to get everything we feel like we deserve in life. Being happy. Peace. Period. Yes. Period. period. So period. Cheers. <laughs> we both got strawberry lemon drops. I'm a hookah girl. Everybody know that. <laughs> Because y'all already know I have my post-workout salad. Yeah, 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 yeah,
I wake up to fight for my yearnings Fear in my mind is a warning Pray to the one you're relying I've been wandering all day Tried to be fine but I can't be The noise in my mind would it leave me Tried to get by but I'm burning I'm behind my mind is running All these thoughts I'm troubling Trying to give up my pain Y'all, so we got a Polaroid camera with only two pictures. films. Two! So it's I got cool. one and she got one. So if this ain't cute, I'm gonna be shit out of luck. Oh, sorry, my girl. Oh my God, I'm so scared. Yeah. Oh. I'm so scared. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna show y'all when you clear up. I should've went and bought some for me. Films. Yes, but that that's what make it fun. Mm -hmm. So this how it sounds out. Coco said it's giving rich auntie. Yes. Yeah, it's real cute. I was scared, y'all. That's how you know you cute. You had one try. You had one try. And I executed it. Super duper. That girl. That girl. Period. <laughs> so y'all, I just pulled up to FedEx. And I know one thing about it, they better give me my motherfucking package. Because every time you come in an establishment like this, they want to give you problems. I'm not the to have a problem. To get to, to give problems, you know? Ooh, I'm gonna, let me squeeze my little. So long story short, y'all. I have oh don't mind me. I look a mess. Long story short, my package is delayed because I forgot to put the apartment number. I commonly forget to do that so i forgot to put the apartment number so i called them snapping on them the operator whatever the hell she is she want to call herself she told me that i would have to wait for the delay to be over so i said i'm the type of bitch put the manager on the phone she like well uh ma'am regardless if i put the, the manager on the phone um there's uh not a not a possibility there may not be a possibility you still get your package Put the girl on the phone back. Put her on the phone. Manager on the phone. She told me that I can come get my package with proof of ID that the name on the uh, package basically matched my ID name and address. So now I'm here, babes. I said, put that motherfucking manager on the phone because y'all always think y'all know something and y'all don't. How y'all tell me I can't get my package? It's been delayed three days. Three days too long. Y'all trying to stop my grind. Like, please. Please. This is a part of my outfit for my marketing campaign so i need it and i just pray i don't have no problems while i'm in the car so i can shit y'all so <laughs> y'all pray for me pray for me so Shanita, what you want to do what you want hi hi, hi. hi. hey girl that's the good kind of we from football oh, team where you from you here i'm from here really hey, <laughs> this is my home girl because I just picked that we from the same place. You did? <laughs> I got my bag. I got my bag. I told y'all. One thing about it, I get whatever I want. Okay? I get whatever I want. <laughs> y'all. So I have to tell y'all something. So the lady that I worked in there, she worked with in there. She African American, y'all. I came in there and I basically told her, like, you know how you gotta try to run down your story. I'm like, yeah, I called and they said I wasn't gonna be able to. She cut me off. She said, uh-uh. What's the tracking number, baby? Because they be lying. Never listen to them on the phone. What did I tell y'all before I went in there? What did I tell y'all? Super duper cool. She was so cute. Like, she was older and everything. So, oh hell no. She was older, like everything. She was super duper cool. And like I said, she was African American, y'all. So when I went in there, I was talking to her like she kind of sounded like me, but like I'm like no. So whenever I go places, y'all, I be trying to network a little bit. So I was telling her what I do and stuff like that, and I was telling her like, yeah, you from here? Cause we start talking about Houston or whatever. She like, no, I'm from Wisconsin. I'm like, I'm from Wisconsin too. She was like, I was like, what part of Wisconsin? She was like Milwaukee. I said, I'm from Milwaukee too. 
Oh, I said that's why we here. That's why we here. That's why we was connecting because we from the same place. Well, she been here for um, she been here for twelve years. I only been here for three and a half years. So, well, Houston for eight months. Texas for three and a half years but I just love that we just vibe like she just was telling me how I'm so cute and y'all she thought my hair was a lace front I was like no sis this is all my hair but y'all I got my package ah, 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 ah. y'all can't wait to open this I dang near want to do an unboxing because it's a it girl piece and it's adding to my collection don't play with it um I ain't seen y'all since I was at lost and found I made it here on 30 miles so now i got 15 miles left so i'm about to go to the gas station and head home for the day um my day is not over today was a busy busy day i got up i worked out um i had to make an errand some errands or whatever after i got done um i got content i got a reel for tomorrow to post for tomorrow i took some pictures too if y'all instagram i'm gonna put them right here and right here and then um I got some pictures I got a reel to upload tomorrow to promote um, myself, I guess. And then tonight, I'm on the way home towards my house. I'm getting some gas first. But me and Keon are recording a video. We are doing, we are making banana pudding, strawberry, strawberry banana pudding and banana pudding. And y'all will probably see that video before I even post this because I've been posting vlog after vlog after vlog. I kind of want to switch it up just a little bit and do like a sit down. So I'll post me and Keon video first. But y'all, I put um, all of me and Keon's. I asked the anonymous, I put an anonymous link, obviously, to my Instagram and told them to um, give me and Keon topics to talk about. Well, questions to answer while we cook to make it interesting, you know? And y'all, literally, look at this. These are all anonymous questions. It's more than 40 questions right here. So. I'm about to go home and I'm about to write all the questions down. Before we start the video, I'm gonna write all the questions down and I'm gonna put them in the middle of the island. We're gonna record the video at Keon's house. So I'm gonna put the questions in the middle of the island and fold them up and put them in the paper. I mean, write them down and put them in a bowl. So as we cooking or baking or whatever you wanna call it today, I'm gonna just, we just gonna pull them out here and there and answer them while we do our, do our shit. So I'm so excited because I love for y'all to see um I love doing videos with my friends so y'all can see like how you know authentic and genuine our friendships is definitely me and Keon um, I'm gonna try to get me and Mal I'm gonna try to get Malika behind the camera um somebody also asked that question um on the anonymous link like they want to see more of her she camera shy she's not even really camera shy y'all like she's not camera shy at all she's just um she's an introvert but it, an extrovert at the same time when she want to be but yeah she just i don't know malika's just off the off the radar but you know she's always around but off the radar but i think i want to do a video with me her and keon and um i want to do a best friend tag like who knows me the best so i'm gonna ask some questions and then i'm gonna have my answers and I'ma have them answer it and whoever like get the best answer, like get a point or something like that. So I'm gonna try to get them to do that this weekend. So then I could drop a vlog and then another sit down. But I'm gonna try to get Malika behind the camera. I'm gonna I'm gonna ask her tonight. But I mean my best friend don't tell me no. So we'll see y'all. We'll see. Hi guys. It is the next day. Y'all, I done had a whole day, you know. I went to the gym at 11 um, and I made some errands after that. So I think that it's Thursday. It's Thursday if y'all didn't know. I think we about to, we're going out today or we will go get some drinks or whatever. Y'all, I'm so sad that Jerry Springer died from cancer. That, ooh, excuse me, that is so sad. Like when people that had an impact like that on like the world and society, like Jerry Springer, real life used to be a thing back in the day. So, like, when people like that die, like, tragically like that, that's so freaking sad, dude. So, <sighs> y'all, that's crazy. So, it is time for me to clean my house because I got to get some type of work done. That's my number one rule. 
in order for me to go out i have to get some type of work done whether that's finishing a video starting to edit a video working on my next project or whatever something productive has to be done so as y'all can probably see my house is a mess so i'm about to straighten up and i'm gonna bring y'all with me i never really get on here and like clean up my house so like y'all really don't even know how i you know clean up i always tell y'all i'm clean up but i never really clean up on here so I ain't gonna do too much talking on here because I'm gonna play my music, but I'm about to hop in the shower because I still have on my clothes for the gym. I'm gonna put the camera up and we're gonna clean up. I really don't have much to do. My kitchen just a mess. And as y'all can see, it's stuff all over the counter. My kitchen is a mess. My living room needs to be straightened up. My room is a mess and I need to throw some clothes in the washer and then in a the dryer and I have to fold some clothes up. So I was gonna take a nap, but I was like, damn, if I take a nap, that's unproductive, right? So I'ma just get in the shower so it can wake me up a little bit and then I'ma clean, start cleaning up. So I don't know you don't even say hey, hold on. But yeah, so I'm about to get ready to get shit done. And yeah. Y'all, my hair does really good at the gym. If anything, it just be my roots that be getting a little puffy. But besides that, my hair does really, really good at the gym. Like, it still be having a little curl to it and stuff. So, yeah. And I gotta tell y'all, who me and, me and Keon had a really, really bad tragedy with our video yesterday. We, more of the story, we recorded our whole video. Like, it was at least like an hour. We were recording for an hour. We made these, y'all. I ain't supposed to be eating this, but we made strawberry and banana pudding and we answered questions while doing that y'all something made me stop in the middle of the video like hold on let me go check the camera real quick the video was not recording like it only recorded like 30 minutes of our video so me and Keon have to do it over tomorrow huh that's so annoying so yeah um I don't even want to talk about it because it ruined our whole night. We were like crushed last night. So, yeah, y'all, let me hop in the shower and I'll see y'all in a minute. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. yeah, sometimes we laugh and sometimes we cry, but I guess you know now. Yeah. Baby. hard to make, so I bet they on their face right now, when he tell the story that's not how I went, know they be lying, I 